Good evening from the Firewall Lounge with your host, Max. Hello. Hello and welcome to the Firewall Lounge or my basement. <laughs> Many of you have already been here before. That's just, I assume, as much. This is our oil computer. As it's already been more de accurately described to you in its technical senses, but overall, what you're looking at is a wonder of efficiency in having done an incredible amount with very little. We have, in fact, been doing so much for so long with so little that we are now qualified to do anything. Excellent. Well put. We have our technician, Mike, who's uh, on duty here at the controls tonight. Our overclocking experiment has gone fairly well, um, and we're still, uh, of course, making uh, improvements and modifications to our uh, full-time cooling system, which is uh, mounted to the left of the computer there, and is now on, functioning, and cooling actively. Maximizing the abilities of the existing hardware. Yep, we have some uh, homemade and home-fashioned parts that are working better than stock. Excellent. Get a quick thirty-five percent. Yep, three point two, thirty-five percent overclock, and uh, our temperatures are really low at this point now. We've had uh, dry ice introduced into the oil bath now for thirty minutes or so. Uh, like I said earlier we removed the CPU fan and put the Chuck it dry directly onto the heat sink. And negative seven to negative five. That's cold. Now eventually, um, with fur further research, development, and experimentation, uh, we would like to, I'm sure, see uh, negative temperatures um, through our uh, cooler. Um, on a regular basis at all times so that the system can run stable. Uh, as far as we can within the laws of physics. That's right. Much lower than uh, than any ambient temperature. Possibly up to 60 or 70 degrees lower. 60 or 70 degrees lower than ambient. And substantial performance because of that. Well, it's back to the number crunching. We're signing off from Firewall.